Hey love bugs, it's Rosalind back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed. I'm doing blessed and highly favored and definitely hope the same for you. And if this is your first time stopping by my channel, much love to you and welcome. And to my returning subs, my grown extended beautiful family, just thank you so much for the love and support that you're giving me, letting me know that you resonate with the videos. And I really think it's awesome for us to all be, you know, going through different situations, but we're all resonating with all the same things that are going on around us so with that being said much love to all namaste love and blessings love and light and many blessings are definitely coming your way and if you have been watching my videos for a while and have not already please what are you waiting for like and subscribe even hit that notification bell so you know when your girls about to upload their next video also if you are comfortable enough i would love for you to drop me a line or two to get to know me as much as i'm get, trying to get to know you or even if it's about you know the, the feedback the positive feedback of the content of my video or you're just up tell me about your empathic gift and how it impacted your life and heading you towards positive direction also if you feel like the videos gave you good vibes or good information you would love to share with a loved one or friend please go ahead and do so and while you're at it uh you can share that or you can give me a thumbs up and share on your social media favorites wherever you see fit and thank you so much for the love and support that you've been giving me i greatly appreciate it and i love y'all from the bottom of my heart and i hope you're able to resonate with the content of my video and today i'm listening to this beautiful meditation it makes me feel so happy just to listen to it um it's called uh cleanse self-doubt release inner struggle confident booster and binarial beats i love binarial beats those are the ones that really get ooh, ooh, excuse me really helps me uh, ascend to where i want my uh, frequency to be and today my video is about uh twin flame 101 doors of blessings are is opening for you that no no one can uh close keep the faith yeah we need to y'all i'm sorry i got so many content subjects that i have to go over it's not even funny so i just okay let me pick this one um just going through the things we go through it's very hard you know we we go through daily struggles every day we're our, our own worst enemy sometimes we get fight you know get into arguments with ourselves like you're trying to motivate yourself to do things you're going through so many different obstacles in your life that you're trying to stay positive trying to stay hopeful trying to stay prayed up you know trying to figure out why things are going the way they happen i mean why they're going on why is it happening this way it's just like when you know you're close to some situation, when you're close to a glow up for yourself or you're having blessings coming forth, you know, you will tend to get knockdowns, you get trips, you know, you get pushed. Like, you know, you're dealing with a bully all the time. You're dealing with, you know, life bullies. And it can be really hard and frustrating at times, you know. Um, being doing this, I, I get all type of situations. It's just like yesterday. I only had my video up for two minutes. Not even two minutes. The next thing you know, I re, uh, refresh my page. I already got a, a thumbs down uh, on, on my video. And I'm like, really? This, this video is nine minutes long. I just not, it, it hadn't even been up a good two minutes yet. And then next thing you know, you want to give me a thumbs down. I'm just like, you know what? Whoever that is, they really need to get a life because <laughs> you're doing the most. And it makes me laugh about stuff like that because I'm like, you're being petty betty. But it's just like, life test is test you all the time to see is the, uh, the littlest thing going to really irk your nerves are you going to be mad about the whole day about something you can't change it's just like so many things is coming forth towards you when you speak the truth and you know that you're doing something in a positive manner you will get stuff like that to happen to you because that lets you know you are on the right path because somebody doesn't want you to you know ascend to go any anywhere else they don't want blessings to come your way they'll either hate on you or try to block you from your stuff and it's sad when people pray against the things that you deserve you know I, i've get i've gotten that lot but you know that there will be things that is coming your way that nobody can't stop you know and when god and universe source you know creator all feel like you know what sam is ready or you know what Sally is ready. No matter what these folks try to do to them, they've earned this situation. They've earned the blessings that they had, you know, clearly asked for. We really feel like they deserve them. And bam, they happen to you right when you least expect it. So it's just like you have to keep 
holding your faith. You got to keep believing that your blessings are coming towards you. You know, you, you go through different things every day to try to test your strength, try to test your faith. You know, when you pray for patience, situations come towards your life to where some stuff you just got to laugh off. You know, just look like, you know, when people do like when stuff happens to me on my, my channel, I just laugh it off. I can put more videos up. As soon as I upload more videos, YouTube is starting to take one or two subscribers off, you know, unsubscribe folks. You know, I'm just like, really? <laughs> really? I, I have to laugh it off because, I, you know, it gets on my nerves. But then you have to laugh stuff like that off because some people don't want to see you rise to anything some people don't like to see you do better you know as long as if you're competition towards anybody nobody's not gonna like that for you so you have to keep going don't worry about what people say about you don't worry about what people think you know keep doing you if you know you're not hurting nobody and you're trying to push out positivity and you're doing things in a good way to uplift yourself you're not hurting nobody you're not stepping on nobody's toes but some people you be stepping on their toes if they feel like you're trying to be inferior or they they see you as a competition they see you as a threat so they'll keep on trying to try you like that but things are going to come your way right when you least expect it you keep doing you you keep pushing out that positivity you know you keep doing what you need to do to better yourself better your surroundings you know get wherever you are out especially if you're in a dark place keep on trying to do the things you need to do and don't worry because stuff good stuff is going to happen you just have to be believing you know it's just like i always pray you know god give me faith for trying to get all through this my faith will constantly be tested all the time you know, I'll always be tested. Like, you know, when I was talking about the, the subscribers getting taken off. Yeah, y'all unsubscribe. And next thing you know, God done sent about three or four other people just to take that place. You know, so it's just like, you know, I ask God, let, allow me to be in somebody's life to help them towards, you know, their journey. Give, make, Have them to make sense of the things that they're going through because it's a scary thought. Now, I know y'all heard me t say this, but it's true. It's a scary thought when you don't know the situations you're going through. You're thinking you're going crazy. You think, you're, you know, you could be going through a midlife crisis if you're in your, you know, your late 30s, early 40s. So you'll be thinking you're going through a midlife crisis. You're thinking, oh my God, am I going crazy? When it easily could be ascension kundalini spiritual awakenings you know dark night of the soul it could be all these things especially if you don't know why you're going through these you know you're heading towards bigger and better blessings next thing you know you hear that ego in the back of your head oh it's not gonna work out for you god done forgot about you creator done forgot about you you won't be stuck in this situation ego will do that because it goes into shock when you try to go into change Ego don't like that. A ego just wants you to stay the same forever. It wants to stay, keep you at that low vibration, you know, and then you're not allowing it to affect you anymore. You know, thought patterns will come back up. That ego will try to play against you. Things that you have went through to try to, you know, keep you in that low frequency to keep thinking about those things. You allow them to keep going. You know, I mean, I have crazy thoughts that comes up in my head. I'm like, why is this coming up? I don't even, you know, and I have to let it just bypass. Like, I don't even say nothing. Like, you know, it's somebody you don't want touching you or something. They got, like, chicken pox or whatever. And you try to step back. Make sure, you know, you don't, they don't touch you. I, I always act like that when it comes to my old memories that I really care less about. So you keep doing you. You keep knowing that better days are coming for you. Your blessings will come. You will see, see signs all the time if they're coming your way. And you, you know what? You keep believing. And when little things happen... You have to be able to, you know, see the bigger picture of the things that are happening in your life. You could be like, why am I getting picked on? Why are these things happening to me? You actually have to step back and look at the bigger picture. Because it's like darkness could be doing that just to upset you. But then universe is allowing this to happen just to see how you're going to react to it. Are you going to react like you used to do and just allow things to get to you and make you stop to do what you were doing? I remember people used to make me mad and I'm like, bump it. I don't want to do it no more. I'm just going to rest in this and this and that. I stopped doing that. I said, you know what? It go ahead and do what they want to do. I'm gonna keep going. You know, when I'm if I stop, it's because I'm tired or I'm drained because I need to get that rest to refuel myself. Other than that, I'm not gonna allow somebody's stupidity or ignorance, you know, stop me from doing what I gotta do because I got a job to do. You know, I got messages to give out, you know, and it's a blessing to be in everybody's lives and be able to tell them, 
you know what? You're stronger than you realize you are. You have confidence in yourself if you can just see what, uh, what, what you can see in yourself. What others see in front of you, that's why they keep messing with you. You know, and let you know you, you are not going to be going through this hurt and pain forever. You know, when you notice that this is the situation that was supposed to make you instead of break you, you know, you had to go through all these pain and sorrows just to know what strength is. You know, when, when you want to make sense of your life, things tend to fall apart so they can be able to add back together. So you have to be realize you have to realize that everything happens for a reason. There's a purpose behind your pain. There's, you know, there's there's a silver lining behind all those clouds. You have to be able to learn how, how to dance in the rain. So it's just like you keep doing you. Find the strength within you and pull it out. You know, there's a lion lion or a lioness in there is ready to roar. And know that, you know, you have everything it takes to do what you need to do. And no matter what people say to you or how bad they try to throw shade on you, keep doing you. Keep having that faith. You know, better days are coming. So I hope you are able to resonate with the content in this video. Send out so much love and light. I hope everybody has a blessed, prosperous week. Um, and my post notification shout out goes to Jenny Lee Rocks, Rook, Rooks and Lisa McDevitt. Much love to you. Like and subscribe. Hit that notification bell. Drop me a line so I can give you a post notification shout out on my next video. And share. And give me a thumbs up. And I'll see you on my next video. Send out as much love and light and positivity as you possibly can. Know that you are truly blessed, highly favored, forever loved. And knowing someone's always out there praying for your better days. I pray for y'all each and every day. And I love you from the bottom of my heart. And I'll see you on my next video. Much love, peace, and be wild.